Hello everyone. Today we are going to see expansion of determinant by rows and columns. Here we have given matrix A and we have to find determinant of A. So first we will write this matrix in determinant form. Okay. So what we have to do here? First we will write here cofactor sign matrix. So we know that what is cofactor sign matrix here? This is yes. We know how we got this cofactor sign. So we got this is here by using this formula. When we have a i j element, we have to write minus one rest to this is here i plus j. Okay, when we want this plus sign, so we will write here a11. This is minus one plus two. This is one plus one. So we get here minus one plus two. This is one, right? So this is here one sign plus. So here we have to write this plus sign and so on here. Okay. So now by use, taking the use of this sign, we will expand this determinant of a. Okay. So we will write this is by expansion by this determinant. This by first row. Okay. So this is our first row. So right. So we will get here determinant of this is. So first element. This is we will write here one and its sign is here plus. So plus into one. Now it's minor. So its minor is here. How to get this minor? This is we have to write element. This is three one one two, which are these elements by avoiding these elements in which this one lies. Okay. So we have taken this remaining element. Now next here we have minus two, the second element. Okay. Then two its minor. Okay. This is minor. How to get this? Avoiding this element in which that two is lies. This is here in first row and second column. So remaining element here. This is two one zero two. Next third element. This is plus three into. So what is here? Three. This is in here. This row and this column. So remaining element. This is two three zero one. So we will solve now. This is here. This is. Okay, how to solve this is this is two by two determinant. We know how to solve this is three into two six and one minus one into one. Next, this is here. What is here? Two into two. This is four minus zero plus three into. So this is here again cross multiplication. This is okay. Now do the simplification. What is here? This is one into five. This is minus two into four minus eight. Then this is three into two six. Okay. So this is five minus eight plus six. What is here? This is what? Yes. So we got here. This is the value of this determinant. This is here by first row. Similarly, we can solve. This is by Second row. What is the value of this determinant? We have to check here. Now this is here second row. So first we will write this two element. So what is the sign of cofactor of this two here? So this is minus. So here we will write minus two. Now in which these two lies? Two lies here in second row and first column. So avoiding this element, remaining are here. Is two, three, and one, two. Then this is plus sign. This plus, okay. Then the plus sign here. Next element. This is three into three minor. This is avoiding this element. So remaining here we have one, three, zero, two. Next here we have third element for third year. Here. Third element we have here negative sign. So this is one and two. So one, avoiding this element. So here we have this is one two 
0, 1 in determinant. Okay, now we will simplify this is here. Minus 2 into this is 4 minus 3 plus 3 into this is 2 minus 0 then minus 1. This is 1 minus 0. Okay, what is simplification? This is 4 minus 3, 1, 1 minus 2 then 3 into 2, 6 minus 1. So here minus 3 plus 6 we get here. This is okay. So here we get this determinant. This is by second row. Now we will check this expansion by column. Okay. So first we will check this expansion by this first column. Okay. So what is here we have? What is first we will write here this is what expansion by first column. Okay. So what is the value of this determinant? What we have to write? We have to write this is cofactor sign plus 1 into this 1. This is remaining element. Avoiding this element. So here we have 3, 1, 1, 2. Then next element with this sign. This is minus 2. Then avoiding this element in which that element lies. So remaining here 2, 3, 1, 2. Next here, this third element, this is here, 0 and 2, it's minor. So, avoiding these elements, remaining here we have 2, 3, 3, 1. Okay, so solve now this is here. This is what? 6 minus 1, then this is 4 minus 3, then 0 and 2, something that is 0. Okay, so we will solve this one here. 2 minus, this is 3 into 3, this is 9, okay. So, this is here, 6 minus 1, 5 into 1, 5, then minus 2, this is 4 minus 3, 1, right, and this is 0. So, this is 5 minus 2, we get here this, okay. So, this is determinant, we got this is by first column. So, similarly, we can check this is by second column, third column. So, we will solve this is by third column. So, what is here? This determinant by third column. So, this is our third column now. So, we will write this third column element. This is cofactor sign plus 3 into its minor. 3 its minor. This is avoiding this element. So, remaining is here. We have to write in determinant form. Then, this is minus, okay. This is minus sign with form with 1. This is 1 and 2. Okay, remaining element, avoiding this element. So, here we have 1, 2, 0, 1. The next we have, this is plus sign. This is into 2, into this 2 minor. So, avoiding this element, remaining here we have 1, 2, 2, 3. Okay, simplification of this is here. This is 3 into this is again determinant. How to solve? 2 minus 0. This is minus 1 and 2. 1 minus 0. Right. Then plus 2 into this is 3 minus 4. What is simplification? This is 6. This is minus 1. This is 3 minus 4 minus 1 minus 1 into 2. So this is minus 2. So, this is here 6 minus 3, we get here 3. So, we get here this is determinant of this matrix. So, we can check that. We can expand this determinant by any row or column and we get the same value. This is here our determinant of this given matrix. So, what is the meaning of this one? We can expand determinant by any row or any column and we get the required value of the determinant. Only we should know cofactor sign. Right. So, this is method of for solving determinant of 3 by 3. Similarly, we can solve 
any n square matrix by using this method. Okay, so this is all about expansion of determinant. Thank you.